Hi there, this is Wayne with Cloud9 Business Apps and we're going to do a short little video here on how you refund a payment that a customer has made using the Stripe system, which is what powers the credit card processing on your booking engine. So basically what you do, well actually first, first what I'll do is mention the reason you can't do it directly in the back end or within the booking engine on your website it's basically for security purposes because people who can manage reservations you uh, don't want them just refunding money to anybody and uh, that might be something you reserve for the owner or general manager or whatever and it has to be done within Stripe so what you do is you go to stripe.com and you log in and you'll end up on your uh, your dash bar, dashboard home page so the customers made a payment so that's where you go is to payments to find the payment that he's made and you want to refund so you can see um, I've basically done one on this payment so we'll grab this payment here which is basically just test data that I've created for doing these videos so we've got this hundred and fourteen dollar payment to the customer which is billing at cloud9businessapps.com and we're gonna go over here on these three dots and refund payment. So when you click refund payment, it's going to come here and ask you how much do you want to refund. It pre-populates the complete amount of that payment. So if you want it to be a partial um, refund, so let's say you have a cancellation policy where you are going to be retaining $50. This is a 114, so if math serves me correctly, you would want to refund only $64. So you just basically type $64. Or wait a second, 114. Yeah, $64. <laughs> and for a reason, we've uh, there's several reasons you can select, but generally you're going to select other and you're just going to type in uh, um, say customer. Whoops, I'm using the wrong keyboard here. Customer cancelled the booking. And you click refund the $64. And now you'll see once this little modal uh, and the processing is finished, that that little window is going to close. And there we go. So now this $114 says there's been a partial refund and if you mouse over it it'll tell you there we go um, oh here it is it's this one we were dealing with we refunded $64 so the customers data is still there the fact that you made a refund is there that's it that's how you refund uh, a customers payment within Stripe Thanks for watching, and we'll talk to you soon. Bye-bye.